Doors blocked on the other side. I'm ready to shoot the infested roots after you bruise the heart. mention how good we are together? Yeah. It's always good to hear. Can you find a way around the locked door? Another key.
There might be a way to open this door from the other side. The imprint in the velvet is shaped like our mirror. Memories from the past linger nearby. Here and now, I lift the curtain. need you no more. What are you <laughs> doing? <laughs> Foolish girl. Please, no. Please don't hurt him. <laughs> Whatever's in this mirror is neither ghost nor spectre. <laughs> Where is Abigail? Abigail has left us, my dears. By what name should we know you? Always that same question, and you know better than to ask it, Antea Duarte. I don't need a name to send the likes of you back from whence you came. I've done it before. How does she know your name? It's not Abigail. It's a... well, some would call it a demon. A bloody pest is what it is. You call us demons, but from where we watch in the great below, we are angels. You poor, transparent, knowable you are upside down. <laughs> What have you done with Abigail? She's here, in a way. I am the pool, deep and dark. She is the ripple that spreads and dies away, returning to the whole, a thing no longer. You're possessing her? How? Huh? We are friends. Such good friends. No, you're a lie. Vapor in the darkness. Really? When you sit beneath a tree alone with no one to talk to, no one to play with, how easy it is to lose yourself. You know nothing about me. Ignore it, Antea. Don't tell me what to do. <laughs> For transparent, knowable you. She... We, it, don't tell me what to... Abigail tried to smash the mirror. She tried to break your hold on her. What happened to her? Are you a happy man, Red Ruri McGraith? Answer the question. Do you feel hollow? What would you do to once again feel her touch? To feel her finger trace lines upon your cheek? What do you want here? Do you feel guilty for leaving your family behind? Was it worth their sacrifice? Are you ashamed? Do you want to hear it from Aoife's mouth? Your sister can't be far. I... no. Abigail wanted to protect John. To the end, she wanted you gone. Abigail made her choice, but she lacked the strength to live with it. <laughs> <laughs>